well. Lovely to see you. At this oh, yes, show. absolutely. Yeah. I, mean, I, mean, I mean, obviously, you're going to go and see the film, but you've I've heard of the work. Purposely not seen anything because I wanted to be here for Danny today and enjoy it with a crowd with popcorn and everything. Isn't it great that you've got a film that's got, um, you know, set in India? No, isn't it great? He's lovely. Set in India, um, obviously in English and Hindi spoken, but isn't yeah. it great that we've come so many years yeah, since Bendy Like Beckham? I, absolutely, you know, and why is it taking so long, you know? Yeah. Uh, but this is a little different because this is an Indian film. Beckham is a British Asian film, so this is more sort of British but Indian as opposed to British Asian. But having, having said that, I mean, some of the cast is say, yes, British Asian. Who says I'm a London boy? Yes. Yeah, so you know, British, you know, member um, of the cast. But Danny's an impeccable so. filmmaker, absolutely no, superb right, filmmaker. So he will have given India a right royal treatment. And uh, who knows? You know, nationality-wise, you can't really say what it is until certainly until I've seen it. I mean, it, it gives you a different view of India, certainly, because yeah. it's set so much in the slums and right. The community that you don't normally see. No, absolutely, yeah. yeah. And you think that you should have more films like this? Oh, absolutely. I think more films that take you into different parts of the world and into different communities, and that's ultimately what cinema is about. So anything that takes you into a world that you don't really know that much about, but you're just treated to a whole hour and a half of it, that's cinema. And what are you up to now? Well, I just finished Angus, so that's opening around the world. It's opening in the States uh, in April next year. And I've started work on my new film. Which is called It's a Wonderful Afterlife, set in Southall, set in uh, Hounslow Southall again. Fantastic. Kind of like Beckham esque, that kind of world. Because I, I live in South, I grew up in South, so I know oh, very well. You know. It makes me very, very proud every time I oh, see Well, my it, people like your mum are, are, are yeah. stars of this one. It was that kind of generation. Excellent. All right. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yeah, good luck. Okay, bye now. Now tell us, why did you decide to take up on part in this project? Well, I, you know, um, I just felt it's, it's a very, very, you know, important film. It's a great idea and uh, you always want to be a part of a great idea and, and a film which is going to be special, which is going to be seen all over the world. And, um, you know, just being part of it, I'm just proud of it. Yeah. And it's a very sympathetic character, isn't it? Yeah. Yes, yes. Hello. Hello. see you slightly in the body, which I know you're used to sometimes. Yeah, but that's, that's... That's what because I, I that's what makes it exciting, you know. For me, it's something which I've never done. So you know, internationally, nobody knows me. So for them, it's be something special. I think you're being a bit Indian because a lot of people do know you. I think especially in London. No, no, but I'm sure for the you know for the international American audience, uh, they're going to see me for the first time. You know. It's like working with Danny Boyle. Oh, awesome! Absolutely awesome! Terrific. How did you prefer yourself for the par character? Do you have specific methods to get yourself into a character or is it all quite depending on the character? Well, you know, everyone's got different ways of, uh, you know, getting into it. But my way is very simple. I just do it very instinctively. Brilliant. What advice would you give to those that want to be actors? Well, uh, just enjoy your work and, you know, and do what you... and, 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 and whatever you do, do with the total commitment integrity and honesty and you know be dedicated towards the art and don't be greedy for money you know money is going to follow you just, just thank you very much. oh thank you very much for that slumdog milton millionaire it was fantastic closing night we got to speak to danny ball among all the cast actors among the producer and the writer it's been a great festival and luckily the film was absolutely beautiful this is alejandra vieja de roda working for smoke tv and smoke newspaper thank you for watching